Welcome to this session on crypto assets and payments. What is RippleNet and how are crypto assets used in the traditional financial system? Crypto assets contain intrinsic values or consist or represent the tokenization of goods from outside the network. The use of crypto assets offers banks and other financial institutions the possibility to decrease costs and improve service quality. Let us take a closer look at how Ripple helps to improve the processing of payments. In contrast to Bitcoin, Ripple Labs is not trying to replace the banks as intermediaries. Ripple provides RippleNet as an efficient platform for connecting payment systems of existing banks. Ripple's digital asset, XRP, complements RippleNet as a bridge currency to enable quick payment transactions even in illiquid currency markets. Ripple cooperates with various banks and financial service providers such as Unicredit, SBI Remit, Santander or American Express. How do Ripple's applied technologies differ from distributed blockchains used for Bitcoin? Ripple enables money transfers from one financial institution to another in real time and with cryptographic encryption. Unlike the crypto pioneer Bitcoin, Ripple does not manage a distributed blockchain, but a large decentralized database. Ripple's register contains IOUs that banks or other financial institutions exchange with each other and track on their subledgers. The register is not updated by a proof of work mining process, but by Ripple's own algorithm. Ripple's algorithm works more efficiently for transaction processing than a proof of work process. In contrast to Bitcoin, the processing of transactions in RippleNet takes place every three to five seconds. In addition, Ripple promotes the use of its digital asset XRP in the transaction process. XRP is pre-mined, meaning that all coins were already created when the system was put into operation. XRP has two functions. It protects against network spam and can be used as a bridge currency in trading with other currencies. As a bridge currency, XRP can enable even faster and inexpensive transactions. RippleNet allows quick currency exchange as well as domestic and international transfers almost free of charge. Banks communicate directly with each other via the RippleNet Messenger. Within RippleNet, gateways such as banks and crypto exchanges act as selected validators. The validators reduce the time for transaction validation and thus the transaction duration to a few seconds. Which steps are necessary to process a payment made through RippleNet? Imagine that a US company wants to pay the invoice of its German supplier. This typical cross-border transaction on RippleNet proceeds as follows. As a starting point, the US company contacts its bank to send a payment to the German supplier's bank account. To begin the transaction origination, the sending bank uses its RippleNet messenger to send a transaction request. This request contains an inquiry to the receiving bank for the required customer information and to RippleNet for the transaction costs and exchange rate. If the US company accepts the payment costs and conditions, both banks exchange the necessary payment processing information. The banks can now meet their compliance money laundering and other data requirements. The US dollar payment amount is then deducted from the bank account of the US company. After converting the payment amount into XRP and deducting the applicable fees, the payment is temporarily held in the subledger of the sending bank. In the next step, a validator in RippleNet validates the transaction by checking if both transaction parties comply with the agreed terms. In case the validation is successful, the XRP payment is debited from the sender's bank subledger and credited to the subledger of the receiving bank in less than three seconds. 
the receiving bank then converts the XRP payment to Euro, based on the agreed exchange rate. After the conversion, the recipient forwards the payment to the German supplier via various payment channels. The receiving bank then notifies the sending bank that the payment has been delivered. To conclude the transaction, both banks confirm that the transaction is complete and notify their customers. What are now the benefits for financial institutions when using XRP as a bridge currency? Ripple's digital asset, XRP and the XRP ledger are open source, permissionless, decentralized blockchain technologies. The use of XRP allows banks to offer high-speed payment processing and settlement around the clock. Institutions also free up capital previously held in pre-funded accounts in the currencies of the payment recipients. Beyond cross-border payments, the Ripple X developer platform offers opportunities to integrate XRP into other use cases, such as e-commerce. For more insights on crypto assets and payments, have a look into the book Fintech Business Models. Thank you.